They are a nationally touring comedy show with a mission to provide a platform for Asian American comedians. Here to tell us more about Crazy Woke Asians are comedians Kiki Young and Dante Chang. Kiki and Dante, thanks so much for being here at Live oh, in the Bay. Thank you for having thanks us. Thanks for having us. Yes, we had so much fun the last time you were here. Tell me what you've been up to since then. Um, since then, I did the Netflix is a Joke Festival. I did the Keenan Thompson um, Comedy Pop-Up Festival in Vegas uh -huh. at Jimmy Kimmel's Comedy Club. And I started doing more like a Cantonese sketches because I'm from Hong Kong. Mm -hmm. So I started embracing my Cantonese side. I love that. And I play like the dim sum lady where I feed everybody hack out siu mai. <laughs> and then I, 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 I do like the the Cantonese mom because mm -hmm. I'm a mom. Mm -hmm. and, I, and I'll be like, Leng zai, Leng lo. Everybody's Leng lo. You Leng lo. I don't know what that means. What does that mean? Pretty girl. Oh, thank yeah, you. Yeah, just say that in I'll Chinatown. I'll take it. I'll take yeah, it. Yeah, go say that in Chinatown. Is that really a bad word? Stuff. Are you giving no. me a bad it word? It is a bad word. It it's is. Like it is. He's Korean. He don't know. It is. It is. <laughs> and what about you, Dante? What have you been up to? Um, just working. <laughs> just working, doing what I do. Just like not, you. Not getting Netflix gigs? Well, like I did the Netflix and joke show with You her. did too. Okay, mm -hmm. good. How yeah. was that, you guys? Oh, it was Kind cool. of. It was, it was a, um, I, I opened for Joe Wong and um, Ahmed Ahmed. It was fun. It was a lot of uh, laughter and it, they had the big red box on there. The Netflix is a joke and I just post all over the box. So did yeah. he? Yeah. You did. You did. I, I don't think, oh, there no, I don't think I did. You took pictures. It was Dante, the you piano. forgot you were dancing in the boxes yeah. there? You forgot? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well, tell me about your show, Dante. You guys are coming to Cobb's Comedy Club tonight. Crazy tonight. Woke Asians. Yeah. This is going to be a hilarious, such a great show. What can people expect when they come tonight? Um, to laugh, <laughs> and you're more likely to have romance after you laugh on a date. Yeah. So yeah. you should come. It will increase your chances. Maybe you can meet someone there, right? Yeah. I'm not worried about that. I just want... <laughs> no, not you. I'm saying <laughs> the guests. Totally. Yeah. Maybe. Maybe. I don't know. That's kind of tough, to be honest. <laughs> you can meet us at the meet and greet. We'll take pictures with you guys. Yeah, you I... can take one of us. Oh, maybe. How possibly. many people are performing tonight, Kiki? Oh, we have a very full lineup. We have a huge spectrum of Asians. Uh, we have uh, him, me, Kitty Pineapple from Vegas. Mm -hmm. She's been on Don't Tell Comedy. Um, uh, Sean Porter from L.A. Uh, he's a regular at Ice House. Sean Felipe, he has a dry bar special. Helen Chu, uh, Elisha Tan. See, I got good memory. Yeah. Um, we have... Panda. Panda, Panda Korean. Panda has a giant head. His head looks like <laughs> a space shuttle. You have to call shuttle. me Panda. That's not his real name, but yes. This is his name. His name You'll is know him when you see him. That's racist, but he'll, he'll his bring head is huge. <laughs> <laughs> what do you um, hope to put on with this show? You guys are nationally touring. Why is this so important? Dante. Um, you know, I just get hired <laughs> by her, and um, I'm, I'm just happy to be here. You just show up, and you make up, people laugh. But I do think she, she does, she did create a platform for Asian people. Yeah. She, she truly does care to grow um, the community, and she has, she's done a great job. What does that mean to you, to put oh, so people important. on and give, the, give them these opportunities? Well, it makes me happy. And you see, like, people that's been in our show, like, they're, like, on, you know, the Late Show, or they're, like, headlining their Netflix is a joke. There's so many people that popped off, mm -hmm. you know, since been, being on the Crazy Vocation show. And it's just great to see different voices showing America, Asians don't all sound alike or say the same thing. <laughs> yeah. Right? And it's just, it just feels good, because I have a theater background, I have a production background, and I was always the only token Asian on all the theater shows, so mm -hmm. I feel so important to put people like this guy yeah. on. Well, Dante, and how did you first get started in comedy? I want to know a little bit about your background. Um, to be honest, um, people kept telling me I should do it, <laughs> and then I said, if 100 people tell me to do it, I'm going to do it, and I counted 200. And you made it, so you started. Were you the funny guy in high school? Usually, yes. Usually. Usually, yes. Yeah, Getting I guess. in trouble a lot. All the time. Can you tell? Yeah. Is it All the time. What is it's one moment nice. that you remember where you were kind of, you know, telling your jokes and like lighting up a room, and that moment stuck with you and made you think, yeah, I can really do this. Um, honestly, it's happened. It happens all the time. <laughs> happens every day. Since you were a child, it's just yeah. been happening. And yeah. it will happen tonight again. <laughs> oh yeah. Oh, yeah. Last night too. Yeah. What is your comedy about tonight um, when you're performing? I, I could, the best way I could put it, I, I'm a habitual line stepper. What does that mean? Um, <laughs> I, I don't want to say anything because we're live and you're, you're just so kind to have us on here. I don't want to get you or myself in trouble. But it's things that I, I can't say right now. Yeah. Right here, Ooh, exciting. I will say tonight if on you stage. come. You'll and get... I might get naked. 
<laughs> I don't know if that's going to sell tickets. Is that going to sell more tickets, Kiki? I would not allow him to do that. That's okay. Okay, I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. Yeah. He's a jokester. I told you. Kiki, club. what are you talking about tonight in oh, your show? Uh, well, I'm going to teach you guys some Cantonese. And uh, I also talk about reverse aging, mm -hmm. neck wrinkles. Yeah, you look super young. Can you tell Thank me all you. your secrets as oh, soon as I we will. go to commercial? What's yes. your number one secret for being so youthful? Uh, I do uh, face uh, yoga, mm -hmm. like, oh, oh, oh. <laughs> it's very ugly. I learned it from Stretching Instagram. and oh, moving your face all you over? Do you do it? No, but There's I... No, no Botox. Wow. See, my Cantonese accent come out. Amazing. I just, I just do this, like, <laughs> and I, it's a whole bit about it. Okay. And then I talk about being my mom, uh, not my mom, I talk about, well, I talk about my mom, also being a mom, also my son, he's a terrorist. Um, yeah, also my <laughs> husband, he's a great cook. They should sell it at Costco, so I talk about that. He's <laughs> great. What's the most fun thing that you look forward to every night on this tour? Um, it's just, you get a, when you hear a roar of laughter, it's a feeling that I can't explain. I love that. That you, that you somehow extended someone's life a little bit. Yeah. What about you, Kiki? Well, totally. The laughter. Oh, I love when people sit in the front row. Mm -hmm. Sit in the front row. Mm -hmm. sit, sit somewhere in the front row. I can roast them. <laughs> and then the, just the, the, their look on their face, and then they're like into it because they get all the attention. Okay, where can people get their tickets tonight and show up to Cobb's Comedy Club? Uh, Cobb'sComedyClub.com for tickets. And it's at 7.30, right? 7.30. Doors at 6.30. All right. 7.30 tonight. Tonight. Kiki, Dante, thank you so much please, for joining us. And have so come, much please. fun. Please.